Morning Slickers. I'm sure lots of you go camping on your scooters, as I do, um, and also camping for fun really. And I'm sure you've also had a lot of cheap airbeds that just go down after not very long, not very warm, hard to pack up on a scooter because they're quite heavy and quite big. Um, well, I want to introduce you to Xped. This is the 5R Duo. It's a two person sleeping mat. Um, fully insulated to four seasons. Um, Xped is a company, you can read all about it on Slug. Um, the outdoor company that specialise in extremes of temperature, extremes of conditions, all this stuff is proper mountaineering equipment and also good for people like us who like to an adventure on a scooter. So um, this particular map, as I say it's four season one, um, it's only about seven, mil, uh, seven centimetres thick uh, compared to like the normal airbed which might be like that. Um, but the difference with this is the insulation. Um, it's also a lot more durable, it's made for going on expeditions, um, so it shouldn't let you down, literally. Um, we'll see how easy it is to put up, because it doesn't actually use a pump, which is uh, a bit unusual, it's got a nozzle bag. So we'll, uh, we'll see how long it takes to put up. Rather than using a pump with this airbed, you use a nozzle bag, um, which is actually a bag that you just fill with air and um, go straight onto the input for your back your airbed get some air in it and pump away but it also doubles as a dry bag which is quite good put your um, stuff that's going to get wet on your scooter into that keeps it dry dual purpose On the airbed, on the airbed, you've got two in vents and two well, two in outlets, two in inlets, and two out outlets. Um, first, we're going to open the in one. So, I'm just going to fit the nozzle back. You can just press it in. That's it. Start the timer. That's a good It's got a one-way valve, so air doesn't come out, which is good. Um, it took 44 seconds that one. Um, do the next one. We might have had a little bit of bearing. Two minutes seventeen to the point. Two hundred. 
probably not a lot different to uh, using a pump. I'll tell you that. If you do need to let some air out, there's a little tool on the end of here, which you poke into there, and you can release a bit of air. For 17 minutes now, and it doesn't seem to be going up a lot. And then I've just realised that I've got the out vent open as well, so I've just closed that. So we'll start again with the timer. 